I'm out on my morning-ish walk. Slept a little later than I would like to, but I decided to start getting out on a little walk in the morning, maybe a run. It's just, gets the, gets the juices flowing. You know, it's what you're meant to do, see a little bit of nature in the morning and set you in a good place for the rest of the day. So I'm gonna finish up my walk and then write a letter to this lady on LinkedIn who's a recruiter for a company I applied for last night. It's a entry level position in a marketing firm that deals with promoting music clients, which is pretty sweet. I mean, it's direct marketing, which is sales, but they're an actual direct marketing firm. They're an actual like firm. They have a legit website. They have legit clients. They aren't one of those scam staffing companies. You know, I might end up doing kind of the same thing, just making cold calls all day, but it's also better than, you know, one that's not a real marketing company. Um, and I'm, I'm happy to make cold calls, get that willingness to breach the va barrier between people and just be like, what's up? So yeah, I, I'm feeling kind of optimistic about that. And there's another one that's in kind of the same position, also in the music industry, which would just be kind of dream come true. But it's all, we'll see, we'll see. And then I think the rest of mine for today are just, I'm gonna try something, try to find something, temp, labor, anything in town until I can get something out of town. From there, I've got a, I got a list. I got a list and I'm gonna follow my list, but I tried to make it much smaller and just focus on like five main things. Because, yeah. Anyway, check out the nature. Pretty comfy. Is that a weed plant? Or is it like poison ivy or something? The hell? Anyway, I love the fact that this place kind of looks like a jungle off to the sides, but if that's kudzu, that sucks. I gotta say that I totally forgot how walking through this park was one of the most, like, peaceful, general times of my tumultuous first years here. Damn, feels good to be back. I love those quick showers in the Texas Hill Country. Two minutes ago I was walking through rain, and now kaboom, Simpsons clouds. That's a setback. I was going to try and take a new LinkedIn photo first. Dressed like my old one, but I have a better haircut now and less less smiley, more friendly, but official. Sadly, gray suit is just, I don't know if they're out, but I just don't feel like I look as good in a gray suit as a black suit. And I feel like it would even probably be a step down because the other one was a professional headshot. So, okay, straight to the messages and we'll see what happens from there. So I looked more into that company and it actually looks kind of sketchy. Looks like what I'm gonna be doing if I do that is just standing outside of like a Petco raising money for stuff. Which, I mean, fine, I guess, um, but I'd rather, I'd rather cold call, man. <laughs> I'd rather do cold calls, uh, and I can get in a cold call place because, like, I can, like, I'm not going to make sales or get donos or whatever if I am standing outside or going door to door. I'm a sweaty dude, and it's just approaching anyone while sweaty is just a recipe for disaster. So I'm thinking apply for that other place, apply for some temp and like more manual jobs here, and then hit my HTML. All right, so I am super encouraged. I got a text from a really good, solid, like nationwide company. It would be a sales trainee program, but the salary and benefits look good. And it, it's not just doing cold calls all day or knocking on doors. I think they liked my customer service experience. They sent a video interview thing where you answer six different interview 
questions over video, one minute each. And there are some written portions. And I really liked that because it was self-timed. It doesn't have the, the problem of having six people staring at you and asking you questions you didn't think of. It also kind of, even if I don't get it, it gave me some ideas of other interview questions that people may ask because I'm very, okay, what's on my resume? They're going to ask me about my resume, know everything on that, perfect, be able to answer for your cover letter when it really was a good way to recalibrate my mind that they'll ask, okay, what, what's the time you messed up and would want to do something different? How do you uh, communicate with people it, at your job? How have you ever had to change your communication style? What's a thing there? Tell me about a professional relationship you built with somebody. So I thought it was really cool. I'm really encouraged. I also got some other like frontline corporate jobs like not lined up, but applied for. And that's the main stuff. That's going to be mostly it for today, guys. Hope everybody else had a pretty good and successful day.